Our first question is one we hear all the time. Are Maddie and Chloe more like friends or rivals? I mean, obviously we're best friends, but sometimes it's kind of hard because we're always competing against each other. It's like healthy competition. Yeah, it's like one day we're best friends, the next day we have to focus and get in our zone. A lot of times I feel compared to Maddie, but I think it's unfair because we're different people, so we shouldn't be compared. When I'm dancing, it should be about me, and then when Maddie's dancing, it should be about Maddie. When we see our girls dance together, we know they belong together. It's a good feeling when you see them on stage. <laughs> I was like so nervous. What? It was good though. Yeah. I mean, we've been best friends since we were, what, four? four. It's like we kind of have felt like each other. <laughs> we live together pretty much half the time. Hey. I'm joking, I love you. You will love me no matter what. Happy, sad, happy. Happy, happy, okay, happy, Okay, I think we're happy. good now. <laughs> Our next question from the fans. Chloe, what's it like knowing Maddie is Abby's favorite? Sometimes I wish that I could experience what it feels like to be the favorite, but I'm who I am today because maybe I'm not the favorite all the time and I have to learn to accept that. Hey. We had a goof. One of our judges, they gave Chloe a 99.10. She actually had a 96.6 because they gave her a 27.5 in the category that only had 25 points. That means that the overall winner would have been Maddie. Maddie and Chloe, congratulations on being great sports. Mistakes happen. The director of the competition told us that there was a mistake in the scores and that um, I didn't really win and Maddie won. And I was a little upset, but I was really happy for Maddie. Mackenzie, what are you doing there with the hairdo? What did I tell you? Never leave home without your bows. Are you kidding me that it just so happened that Chloe and Maddie's scores were the only ones out of the entire competition with 80-some routines that were incorrect? Are you kidding? Well, that was really sad. I would hate to be in that situation. I, I hated it really bad because, yeah, like, I, this is Chloe's one chance. I think that that day was really hard because one day I had the trophy and then the next it was kind of like, well, dangling it in front of your face and then being like, you don't get to keep it. But I think that overall it made me a stronger person. This question from the fans is for Maddie. Have you ever been yelled at by Miss Abby? Sometimes it's hard being one of Abby's like favorites because there's so much pressure on me. Abby's always like, well, Maddie can do this and Maddie can do this. I'm like, you know, I really can't do all that stuff. <laughs> and it's like, I have to work so hard and I feel bad half the time. I remember when you had to beg to dance because Abby said you didn't have the passion. I'm at the studio every second minute hour of the day and it just, like, I had to beg to have a solo because she wouldn't give it to me for three weeks because she thought I wasn't dedicated. I, like, used to cry when I went to sleep at night because I was like, she doesn't like me. She doesn't want me to dance anymore. My mom encouraged me to go talk to Abby and say I was ready to do a solo. Well, I'm totally confident, and I'm ready to compete. Are you ready? Yes. Can you beat everybody? I think. Well, you, but you don't look, you're like, yes, I think yes. But if you don't want to do it, don't do it. Nobody I cares. Would. You act like someone's making you do it. I want to do my solo. I think I can do my solo. I'm ready to do my solo. Very wishy-washy. That's not a game face. That's not the Maddie face I know. The Maddie that's jumping and warming up, trying to psych Chloe out. You go out there with that face, she's going to beat the crap out of you. Stop with the tears. Babies cry. Not you. Do you understand that? Yes. It's my dance company. I say who's dancing and who isn't. So sad. Well, now you know how I feel every yeah. day. Yeah. But it was only three weeks. You only had a solo three times in one season. <laughs> that is true, Nia. <laughs> it was three weeks without a solo. I actually did tell my mom. I was just like, now I know how Nia feels. <laughs>